Greetings and welcome everybody. I'm humble. We are all humble. Both Jenny and I started the journey together with the Labour Party. And here we are, amongst you all, back here where it all began. And it's important that we thank each and every one of you for coming out. But that's enough for me. I'm going to hand it over to Jenny to speak to us all, and she'll introduce our Prime Minister, Kia ora Tata. Yeah. Kia ora koutou katoa, Nissan Bulawinaka, Happy Fijian Language Week everyone. And to all of you, today is Fiji Independence Day, and I wish you all the best as you celebrate. As my brother Peony Henare, the Honourable um, uh, Willie Jackson is also here, has said, and of course, the Right Honourable Prime Minister Jacinda Ardern. Yeah. Last time, we ask you for your support. We thank you humbly, Ōtara, Patatoetoe, all of the South Side, for the support that you continue to give us. Please remind all your whānau. The voting booth is just around the corner here at Te Puke Ōtara. It is important that you enrol and vote. Party vote is what we need from you. Because in order for us to get back into government and for the Prime Minister, the Right Honourable Jacinda Ardern, to continue to lead our country, we need your party vote. You can be through a few issues. March 15th, Pakari White Island, and right now, with COVID-19, this is the leadership you need. We cannot change it right now. Give your vote, party vote to Labour. Welcome the Right Honourable Jacinda Ardern, Ōtara. Thank you so much. Thank you. Special, special Bula Vanaka, given its Fiji and language week. And thank you everyone for joining us here this morning. And can I start by saying to everyone, who supported us in 2017 and made sure that Labour could lead a government, I say thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much for your support. Your support made all the difference. And now we are here again with my colleagues here, with all of the MPs who have been working so hard to say we're asking for your support again. You have it. And we're asking for that support for a couple of reasons. Firstly, these have been hard times for New Zealand. And there are hard times in front of us right now. There's lots of uncertainty. There's been a lot of difficulties for Fano, for our business owners, for the likes of those who are here as storeholders, there have been tough times. But we know if we want to get through those tough times, we have to stick together. In the way that the team of 5 million already has, and we need to keep going. Now in Labour we have a plan. Our plan is about looking after our small businesses. It's about looking after our Fano. It's about making sure that anyone who might have lost their job has the chance to find new work, has the chance to be trained with free apprenticeships, has the chance to earn a decent wage by continuing to lift the minimum wage. roof over their heads. These are tough times, but we can keep moving as a nation. We can keep making things better. So that's why we're asking for your support. You've got it, Jacinda, you've got it. Yeah. Yeah. So, to each of you, it's been a long campaign, the voice is going. <laughs> <laughs> so to each of you, I can guarantee you that I am going to keep going. Yeah! I will work every day to earn your vote and to earn your support. But now we're asking you, today, to give your vote to Labour. Yeah! And today, there are more polls open than there were yesterday. And there'll be even more on October 17th. So please, let's stick together. And let's 
keep moving. Two ticks later. Thank you so much to all of you supporters for being here. We love you, Prime Minister. Thank you for all the work you've done to keep all of us safe. And thank you for coming back to Ontara. We love you. We love Jacinda. We love Jacinda. We love Jacinda. Let's go, Labour. Let's go, Labour.